Hello there friends, I hope that you're doing well. So in this video I'm going to show you how to disassemble, assemble, uh, clean uh, Tektro mechanical uh, disc brake. So this is the caliper. I already opened up uh, this part here. Uh, so I'm going to show you uh, exactly how you can uh, assemble it back. So uh, we have here a simple coil with this part that goes into this hole here like this then we have a dust cap and it also has this small hole here that goes like this and this arm which uh, also has that hole so it's impossible to just uh, place it in the wrong position once you align uh, everything with your left hand you just keep it pressed and you just uh, put the bolt back in so the idea is that uh, if you want to clean this uh, mechanical disc brakes you will need to take off the bolt remove the arm remove the dust cap and remove the coil and in this case usually you need to clean this area this is where uh, dust gets in and uh, a lot of other stuff uh, if you do all of this the the caliber here which is magnetic will uh, join the other one from this side so you'll not be able to, to put everything back you'll need to remove this side as well which is quite easy you can ignore this bolt from the middle this one is for adjusting the, the distance the gap uh, in order to remove this one the right side you'll need to remove these two bolts so remove the bolts okay And you need to be careful because there are three bearings in here. It's really bad if you if you lose them. As you can see, one here and two here. Okay, so uh, remove the bearings and be very careful where you place them, or you can just leave them like that. Okay, so these are the three bearings. Uh, you will want to to clean them a bit. Okay. Okay, and this part which was uh, joined here because it's magnetic, you can take it out, uh, you place the bearings, uh, it's impossible to place them wrong because uh, it has here some gaps, okay, and you place the the bearings then you place this part here like this and you just adjust it with your hand move it a bit then you will need to assemble everything back meaning the coil you place the coil first the part which is more straight goes into the hole uh, in my case is this one like this then you place the dust cap uh, 
like this and then the arm meanwhile uh, be careful not to drop all the mechanisms because uh, you might lose the, the bearings like this and you just move it a bit so you can adjust it once you have it like this you can just insert the bolt and uh, screw it okay and do not move the arm you can only move it only a little bit but if you move it too much uh, you might mess up the coil and everything will just jump okay uh, now it's pretty easy the other side just uh, place the two bolts screw them uh, a little bit on each side so you don't uh, mess up the threads and the, the bolt should go all the way in So these two bolts need to be tightened very well. Okay. This one you can unscrew it and uh, when you put it on the bicycle you need to screw it back and uh, adjust the, the gap uh, between the, these two calipers so they will hold the, the disc brake. Alright, so you're uh, pretty much done. It goes like this. It moves very easy. And you should definitely not put uh, grease inside uh, near the coil or the bearings. And definitely not oil because uh, uh, there might be a chance that oil will go into the braking pads and on the disc brake and that will be really bad so if it moves freely like this it's fine uh, I would advise you to not open it uh, unless it's uh, it's not moving because there is a chance to lose the bearings uh, and you might have a hard time to find replacements with the exact same size so uh, this is how you can uh, disassemble, assemble, clean a uh, Tektro disc brake caliper. I hope that you found the video useful. If you did, please subscribe and thank you for watching.